Okay, welcome to the second part. Here we we'll start sculpting this. And first, let's go to sculpting view. This basically will change, like set up everything for us, and we will ha also have a matcap. And matcap is just a type of shading that will help us to see shapes of the rock, so this will be easier. Okay, so now when you go to sculpting, uh, turn on din topo, din topo, I don't know, and uh, change the detailing to constant detail. So you have everywhere the same detail, constant detail. Okay, here you can change the brushes. So mostly I will use uh, this brush, it, it is called uh, scrape and you can change brushes by pressing uh, no, by, by pressing here. So well, after enabling line topo, press this picker and uh, yeah, pick the mesh to so, so this will examine what detail is, is it is now. So now it's it it is like 1.82. So we want it to be higher. So we can sculpt on it. So change it to 50 or 30. It depends on your computer. If it's strong, you can change it to higher. So now, after if you sculpt, the mesh will be changed, like split it into smaller vertices. Yeah. Okay. So after after this, you go down into remesh section and press detail flat fill so basically it will flat fill our mesh and everything will be at this resolution so now look this is low resolution and if you press detail flat fill the mesh won't change but uh, it will be split it into smaller vertices so it's very high now so after this you can turn off line topo and now it is easier to scope go i lost my matcap so go to layout and sculpting again or, or no wait <laughs> go to shading hmm what the fuck wait a minute Ah, okay. Mm, change to solid. Okay, never mind. Okay, so now we can start start sculpting. So change to square brush here, and basically this brush just flattens our mesh. So, for example, if you want to flatten here, just draw on it, and this will be flattened. Okay, so now just continue flattening your rock and just define the shapes that you, you like. Okay, if, if you want to, to make brush harder, go to stroke go to curve and uh, enable this choose this this type of curve so this will uh, this now this brush will be harder now Okay, if you have rigged edges like here, for example, you can press shift and this will change to a smooth brush and basically this will smooth these rigged edges. Okay, 
気使って。Go and make details. So change brush to clay strips and with control you can invert the, the brush. Yeah, so this is normally how it works and by pressing control you invert it so you indent into the, the rock. So we can add for example some indents here just to make it more organic. Uh, you can adjust the strength by pressing shift F and make it like stronger and now you can press hard into the rock and just play with it like Here I'm just slightly adding texture, so I slightly press into the rock, make strokes like this, and after everything I smooth it out, so this will add a texture to the rock. Yeah, and I do it like basically everywhere
okay so after this step we can add some scratches so you select uh, crease brush which is this one change the curve to this one so this will be pointy and let's see yeah Yeah, this, this looks like scratches. So here, here tablet is uh, very. It's it's not needed, but it's good to have it because uh, you can adjust the pressure to the size of the brush. So if I press very strong, the size will be bigger, and if I press lightly, the size will be smaller. So, let's do some scratches. The last step is just making edges sharper so you have to change to pinch brush which is this one and this will pinch vertices closer to each other so basically it will make the edge harder like you see here so uh, when you want hard edge just use this one and we can make hard edges again. This side is quite flat so I will change it by changing to crease brush and adding a crease, crease here and then changing to scrape brush I will flatten this those sides so this won't look so flat anymore. And by pressing pressing to changing to clay, clay strips add again some texture Okay, I think this is okay. Yeah, you can do it. You can spend more time on it if you want. But uh, I think this is okay for the purpose of the tutorial. So I won't, won't add anything more. So this is it. Okay, so now we can move to the retopology stage in the next part. See you.